Howdy campers and welcome back to another episode of Collection Log Completionist, the series where I do way too many clue scrolls. Almost all of these easy clues were both completed and opened while I was streaming on Twitch, so if you'd like to see me do any of this live, then come over to twitch.tv forward slash camping online. Tonight I'm going to be live from 6 to 8 CST, so swing on by if you're still awake and you can watch me do some Konar Slayer. What in the absolute heck did they do over here? When the freaking heck? And there's a port here too? Man, I do not remember anyone ever even mentioning that they redid this area by the desert, but I'm guessing it's for the upcoming Desert Treasure 2 quest, but I had not even heard that this had happened absolutely game changer bud we have got our first set of 100 easy caskets to open up just gonna open up 100 at a time that is not where i wanted to go just gonna open them up 100 at a time and this here is the easy clue log obviously just missing the monk robe top but even a duplicate monk robe bottom would also be nice and I'll also take a cape of skulls. The fact that we only have one cape of skulls is pretty absurd. Well, nothing too interesting from the first 100, but I'll come back to you when I have the next 100. All right, 100 more easy clues to open up. Oh, look at that. Team Cape X, very nice. There we go, a master, nice. Another master, very nice. All radio, 19 more. Never lucky. If I could get another pair of flared trousers to rub and borrow Iron's face, that would be nice as well. Better have an IRL max hit? I, I wish I did, it would be so cool. That was part of the idea with the profile picture, was I'm like, wouldn't it be great if I had a, a like max hoodie? Cause I'm, I always wear hoodies with the hoods up. That was a pretty underwhelming 125 easies, damn. And then since Theo keeps complaining about it, we'll open up the five masters as well. Tiara, not a new unique, unfortunately. No way! That's the first piece of duplicate gilded that we've gotten. That's a bit unfortunate that it's a dupe, but I am never gonna be upset with a piece of gilded. That, uh, I was not expecting to get that just from opening those five masters like that. I guess, uh, thank you, Theo, for making me open those. That's a pretty exciting way to end the stream, at least. Yeah, rangers were the second to last item that I got in order to complete the log. I'm borderline a little upset I didn't get them for my last item because I think that would have been funny, but beggars can't be choosers, I guess.
Never lucky. Nothing interesting this time, unfortunately. Open up the master. I guess I can do that. Unless you, I think I've got some elites and hards around here. Personally, you would have gotten the monk's robe piece. Damn, I'll, I'll consider that next time. Open the master. Okay. If you insist. <laughs> Thank you, Ramdahl. That's what I'm talking about. Ramdahl forced me to open up this master clue and we get a new collection log slot. Ramdolph knows what he's talking about, man. Minecraft server one. Now the campers could get out and actually move around in a Minecraft world, maybe. Not really real camping, but you know, better than nothing, I suppose. The people have spoken. Time to open up 29 clues here at the Perf Bank. So far, it's looking like this might not have been the move. There we go, a master at least. 28 more. Dang, that was honestly a pretty underwhelming nine hours of easy clues. Not even many masters to do either. That's pretty unfortunate. During one of my streams, I don't remember who it was. I think it was Terror Earth or Petville mentioned that you can actually add notes to these clue steps now. If you shift right click on it, then you can set a note. So like for some of these where it gives me this massive block of text that I don't care about, I can just put a note that says Falador Ring. And I know that I just use the Ring of Wealth to teleport to Falador and it's that easy. Honestly huge for a couple of these steps. It is quite nice, especially for some of those steps like the ones in Falador where depending on where in Falador it is changes what teleport I use. Like this clue here. It says Remington, but this isn't Remington. This is obviously Ring of the Elements and then teleport to the air altar. So I can go set note, Ring of the Elements, air altar. So now next time I can see that note and be like, oh, no, I don't want to teleport to Remington. I actually want to teleport air altar. Look, it puts me right here. So we've got 100 easy caskets to open up. You see that eight fire lighters for a reward? That's uh, that is suboptimal. <laughs> 221 coins that's um i think that's the worst easy clue reward i've gotten before i've had some pretty rough ones but eight fire lighters is is bad shaking my head all right one master at least Nothing interesting. Master to open up. That is no unique. Unfortunately, you are correct, Arawak. Oh, another master. Okie dokie, master. Hey, that's a unique one that we've already got. Back to the easy clues. Hey, there we go. There are the flared trousers that we were looking for. Thank goodness that uh, Borrow Iron isn't still here. Otherwise, he would be very upset, I'm sure. Ooh, Team Cape Axe. 
like back to back basically. Well, that was a pretty solid way to end her out. So only one new log slot this week, which is unfortunate, but the Gilded Roll is awesome. And moving over to Konar Slayer, we've got a ton of log slots that we should be able to get somewhat easily. So I have a feeling our total collections logged is going to go up pretty quickly in the next week here. I've got it on good authority. But as always, make sure to subscribe so you too can become a camper without ever having to touch grass. And make sure to check me out on Twitch and follow me on Twitter in order to get announcements about new videos and me going live on Twitch. So take care, and until next time, happy camping.